you're looking at the fastest sailboat in the world. That's right, it's a French experimental boat called L'Hydroptère. And this 70-foot trimaran with its marine-style wings practically flies on the water. I took a ride with its skipper, Alain Thébault, who first dreamed up the design as a young child. When I was back uh, at school, I was 10, I explained to my teacher, I want to stop my studies, I want to fly. Since you were 10, you started designing then? It's one life. Yeah. And the engine is passion. I have no watch, no calendar, no schedule, nothing. Just uh, the wind, my paper, my pen, my passion. The first time that yes. you built the boat, the première fois. Oui. Quel est différent maintenant? Oh What no, is different everything now? is different on the detail. When I started, I started on a scale model, mm -hmm. a wooden scale model, and uh, the boat, uh, the stability was not good. And progressively, after I wanted to, to design another one, a one third scale model. I was living outside, I had no house, and during six months I was outside with my carbon fiber, my aluminum, and I had the first help from aeronautic engineers. They say, what are you doing with your crazy uh, project? <laughs> it was a dream. Uh, I was uh, 18. Somehow you have gotten people to give you money to keep building flying boats. Yes, look, I started... How do I not have that job? I want that job. <laughs> His passion has taken him all over the world, chasing sailing's biggest speed records. Three years ago, we broke the absolute speed record over one nautical mile. Our top speed was around 56 knots, 105 kilometers. In case you didn't get that, he said 56 knots. That's almost 65 miles an hour. And it feels even faster when you're on the boat. The technology that makes this boat so fast mostly comes from airplanes. You have the wing design, right, Bernoulli principle, to get lift. Okay, in the water, it's exactly the same. We use wings working in the water, and uh, we create over 12 knots, we create lift. The boat takes off, yeah. and the hulls are out of the water. There is no drag, and uh, progressively, the, the acceleration is really powerful because we have no drag. Over 100 kilometers, we have only two square meters in the water. Table is not a one-man band. He has a team of five others, including his co-skipper, Jacques Vincent. My co-skipper, Jaco, was eight times around the world. Yeah. Yeah. He's the most experimented guy on board, but the the most cool, <laughs> the most crazy. Mm. <laughs> oh no, I can kiss you. <laughs> you no, I prefer Molly. <laughs> you don't think she looks very merci, different merci. since she sailed with us? She's yes, more... yes, she's huh? another woman. Another woman. I am. Huh? I'm, I'm, I changed. I am changed from my experience on Italo. Ah. Okay, on part avec celle-là. Here we are. you have one guy. Three on the deck. Here in La Terrasse. In La Terrasse. And three inside, sleeping, or cooking, or living here. In l'hôtel. Yes, yes, come on, Moni. They are living terrasse. here, come on. It is a l'hôtel. Yes, a l'hôtel. A l'hôtel. Come on, Moni. I will, I will show you. Look, come on, through the kitchen. Here is the kitchen. <laughs> here is the kitchen. Here is the bathroom. And fork, nice, it's hydraulic maintenance, when you can enter here. What? I'm, I'm living here, near the kitchen. So wait, there you're sleeping? Oh. The door. Yes. <laughs> here, yes, here is uh, our measurement system engineer, facing the computers. And me, I'm living here. Inside, there's a sweet spot to live. One is sleeping here, the boss, and two guys here. And we have only donc, uh, the bathroom, the kitchen, and the computer and measurement systems. Wait, I thought that was the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Everything yes. is the and, uh, bathroom in here. <laughs> <laughs> So now it's perfect? Never perfect. perfect no, never perfect. Oh, but perfect. Uh, but uh, I wanted to fly, job done. Now I want to cross the Pacific, the, the Transpac, yeah. the Pacific between LA and Hawaii next spring. And after, I would like to cross the Atlantic in two days and a half with a new boat, a new design. Oh, really? I'm on the design at the moment, and the ultimate dream is to, to fly you know, around the planet. But we need to stay humble. Yeah, <laughs> one thing at a time. We need to stay humble. <laughs>